Good morning, Great Little Trove. From WCAT TV studio, I'm Alex Pizzignani, alongside Joanna Perry, and these are your morning announcements. Attention all freshmen and sophomores, it is time to elect class officers for the 2017-2018 school year. If you are interested in running for class president, vice president, secretary, or treasurer for the upcoming school year, please pick up the class officer's candidate form and a requirements and duty sheet outside of Ms. Feeder's room, S209, or outside of Ms. Feeder's room, D2. All forms are due to either Ms. Suter or Ms. Fedor by the end of the day, Monday, September 25th, to help make a difference next school year. Underclassmen pictures will be taken today during the social studies class. If you do not have a social studies class, please report to the auditorium during a study hall or immediately after your lunch. Mrs. Albright will be collecting the $16 test fee from sophomores interested in taking the PSATs during seminar and homeroom periods on Thursday, September 21st. This fee must be in check form made out to the GLSD, while the ASVAB is the preferred option for sophomores. Any student wishing to take the PSAT instead must prepay and register on September 21st with Mrs. Albright in the 910 office. The Greater Lake Chobe Senior and Junior High Student Councils are working with those at Penn Trafford to collect funds for schools that were damaged in recent hurricanes. Donations will be collected at all gates at Lake Chobe Memorial Stadium before the game on Friday, September 22nd. Let's work together to help rebuild their schools. Do you want to make a difference in your local community? Want to be a part of a national movement across America? Learn to be a great leader while making a real impact through Chick-fil-A Leader Academy. Join over 18,000 students in 600 other high schools nationwide in a leadership program focused on impact through action. Go to chickfilaleaderacademy.com slash apply to apply now for a spot in Chick-fil-A Leader Academy at Great Latrobe this year. 30 Great Latrobe students in grades 9 through 12 will be selected for the program. If you participated last year, you are not eligible to participate this year. The deadline to apply is Friday, September 22nd. See Ms. Cubis in H108 with any questions. Come out and support the golf team this weekend at the Eastgate Chick-fil-A. If you mention Latrobe Golf Team when you order on Saturday, September 23rd, Chick-fil-A will donate a portion of your bill to the golf team. This runs all day long, so just be sure to mention the golf team when ordering. Now, here's Molly Cunningham with the sports report. Good morning, Wildcats. I'm Molly Cunningham here with your sports report. Today, the freshman boys football team have a home game at 3.30 against PT. Boys soccer will be heading out to home field for their 6 o'clock, 7.30 game. The girls field hockey team was moved to an away game at Pine Richland. That's all for your Wildcats sports report. Back to you guys will be in the cafeteria during all lunch. Waynesburg will visit today and Army will be here on Friday. A reminder that all juniors and seniors who go on college visits must complete a yellow college visit pass, which can be picked up in the 11th-12th grade student waiting area. Morning at 7 a.m. in the library every Friday. This Friday we will start with an introduction to using the little bit. Don't be intimidated. Ms. Reval will be on hand to demonstrate and answer questions. Students are also invited to use the products independently or with friends during seminar time, study halls, or after school on Tuesday and Thursday. Now, here's Michael Dunlap with the weather. Why, good morning to all you Latrobians out there. This is Michael Dunlap reporting for WCAT TV Weather. This is a wonderful time to be alive. The weather is going to be absolutely fabulous these next few days, unless you like cold weather, in which case it's not going to be so wonderful. Your three-day outlook is looking awfully sunshiny. Today is going to have sunny skies with a high of 82 and a low of 57. Tomorrow is going to bring us more sunshine with a high of 52 and a low of around 55 for those of you young and old going out to the game and tailgate Friday. And we'll enter this much needed weekend with a high of a toasty 82 again and a low of 57. Winds light and variable on these next three days. That's all for weather this bright morning. Back to you. Thanks, Michael. The forensics team season is getting underway. So make plans to hang out in B6 Junior High with Dr. Bumpy Annie Smith and hear about all the exciting things happening. Practices are held Mondays, and our first one will be Monday, October 2nd, after school until 4, in Dr. Bump Bumpy Annie Smith's room. On October 11th, Great Little Trobe will host the season's first speech festival. Events will include poetry, prose, impromptu, radio, drama, humor, and duo. The festival will be held in the senior high. Team members will meet with Dr. Bompioni Smith after school, and then speaking takes place from 4 to 6. Check out information on her teacher page, and if interested, stop by practice. 
You can also ask current team members Paige Lesko, Jason Starr, Lydia Daly, Marley Nicole, Gabby Oldenburg, and Mariana Strack. If you cannot make practice, stop by B6 in the junior high for information and to sign up to attend on the 11th. Or send Dr. Bompiani Smith an email so that you can get on the list. Remember, you must submit a blue medical form to Dr. Bompiani Smith and sign up with her in order to attend. For WCAT TV, this has been Gianna Ferry and Alex Bizignani. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Very special announcement.